Hey, do you like playing games? By the way, I am Shalwani and today we are going to speak about game development. Do you know how cool it is being a game developer? This industry is already blooming and by 2025, it's going to be a best in class career option. Game design is an art of applying aesthetics to create a game for entertainment or experimental purposes or educational exercise. Increasingly, elements and principles of game design are also applied in other principles in the form of gamification. For decades, video games have entertained children and adults alike. Today, 64% of US households own a device used to play video games says the Entertainment Software Association. Video games have evolved rapidly from the early days, offering increasingly realistic experiences that no longer resemble the pixelated screens and 8-bit games of past generations. Today, the field of video game development is lucrative one offering plenty of career options. According to a report by Juniper Research, the gaming industry generated $155 billion in revenue in 2020 and it is predicted to generate over $260 billion in revenue by 2025. Leading companies are fiercely competing for a share of the market with tech giants like Apple, Netflix, Facebook and Google entering the gaming market. With gaming becoming such a huge force worldwide, there has never been a better time to pursue game development. Having the knowledge of best game development language can be your first step in this journey. This video will help you in knowing the aspects of game design, the important languages you need to know and the free resources that can help you get started in the video programming journey. So now let's see how you can design a game. There are a few things in game designing like designing the gameplay, covering the components, designing visuals, designing the audio, designing your story and the characters. You must be wondering how coding can help you in becoming a game designer. Coding is an essential part of the process. Without it, you cannot do much. Not all people in game development do coding, but in most of the studios, half of the people might be creating a code. In the modern era, most of the games are made with engines. Engines are the game code and toolset which can be applied to any games. Engines are either built in-house or bought from an external vendor so that that part of the code can be avoided. But even then, there's code to be written. Engines often need custom code to support specific features, effects and shaders. A game's coding language is chosen following the development of the game's initial design. Games are developed using a variety of programming languages depending on the platform it may be a console, computer or a mobile and the scope of the game. Now that you know that coding is important for game development, we have a set of programming languages that can help you get started in this journey. Some of them are C++, Java, JavaScript, HTML5, Python and many more. Now that you know that coding is important for game development and what are the languages that can help you in game development, let's see how Brightchamps can help you. For kids, Brightchamps provides a well-rounded experiential learning that ranges from design thinking to robotics, coding fundamentals to coding math, scientific exploration. Young kids in particular have higher potential for fast conceptual acquisition. Design thinking, complex problem solving, critical thinking, decision making, coordination with others and higher emotional intelligence are just a few attributes that kids can develop with correct nurturing. At Brightchamps, kids are holistically taught all these skills by the meticulously crafted curriculum and efficient teachers. What makes it even more unique is that, in addition to these practical skills, their soft skills are also cultivated at the same time, adding value to their work. In addition to focusing on a positive educational experience for you, Brightchamps recognizes the worth of your smile on your face when you list your first game designed by yourself. Watch out the channel for more videos on game designing and other coding stuff. Stay tuned and keep learning.